Good evening. I am Megan Glover here at Cajun Field for a robbery, a Sunbelt nightcap between Louisiana and Southern Miss. Now, this contest is a story of brotherly love. We see it all the time in the NFL. You see the Kelseys or you see the Mannings dynasty. Well, tonight I introduce you to the Malirans who bring a special talent to their squad. Football is a fraternity of brothers fighting for the same goal, a special bond of players who strive to win. For Louisiana sophomore Carter Malarin, he fell in love with football at six years old. His best memories include playing backyard ball with his older brother, Brennan. Just as he kind of grew into like what he is, like he kept getting better and better and better, um, he would keep teaching me and telling me what he's doing, and I would keep getting better and better and better. As Brennan got older because of his size, it was hard for him to touch the field until he learned how to become a long snapper. On the other hand, Carter had opportunities at linebacker, but because of Big Bro, he decided that long snapper was the best fit for him as well. Just like kind of watching him do it uh, kind of was like, I don't know, it, was, it intrigued me a little bit. He would show me all the drills and stuff and like I would try and do it back and uh, I think in a sense, I would try and do it better, see if I could be a little better than him. The Malaren men went on to have success on the collegiate level. Brennan walked on at Troy before transferring to Southern Miss, earning a scholarship. Carter named a starter as a true freshman for the Cajuns last season. I've always kind of excelled. Um, like even when I was young, I was kind of top of the class with some of the guys. I've always kind of competed with the top guys. And so if I ever lost, uh, I would work really, really hard to better myself to make sure I would never lose again. And on November 9th, a date that the entire family circled on the schedule. The duo will reunite in Cajun Field to show some brotherly love. And for Carter, he says it's a dream come true. This week has been different. So me and my brother kind of, we talk, I would say, every day. Um, and it's just been more kind of back and forth, kind of like when we were kids. We would just talk a little bit of smack towards each other. Um, you know, I'm just like, you know, every time I every time I talk to him, I'm like, so are you guys ready to come down to Lafayette and lose? And he's like, ah, you know, so I just I give him a hard time. He gives me a hard time and it's it's a lot of fun. But at the end of the day, you know, there's no love lost. Um, it's still just I mean, we're just kids playing a game. So. And check this out, both brothers share the number 39. Brennan had dibs on it first, and when Carter got here, he was given the number 40 until he asked if he could change his number to 39 to match his brothers.